Hello and welcome to the last diet of your life. About a year and a half ago, I found the world's easiest, most effective, most sustainable diet. And I got from here to here. That's how I knew it was the easiest. That's how I knew that anyone could do it. I put my videos here on YouTube so people could watch them for free. And a lot of people told me that I motivated them to go out and exercise. Other people told me that they lost 10 or 15 pounds. But no one that I know of did what I did and went from where they were unhappy with their physique to where they were happy with their physique. And so I started to wonder. Everyone always says the last 10 or 15 pounds are the hardest to lose. And so I lost the last 10 pounds live on my YouTube channel. They were the easiest pounds to lose. So 194.8, 192 even, 190 even, 188.8. Wow, my goal was 185. I realized that the most difficult part of any diet is the beginning. So I did the stupid, most dedicated thing that I could think to do. I put the weight back on. This is me at 185 pounds just six months ago. And here's me today, 225 pounds. That's not sticking out. That's sticking out. I deliberately put on 40 pounds of fat just to help you get through the hardest part of any diet, getting started. I know that I'm going to lose the weight. I did it before. This time, let's succeed together. By this summer, I will have lost all 40 pounds. And even if you have more than 40 pounds to lose, by the time you've lost 40 pounds with me, you'll have this diet down. For the past several months, I have been eating horribly. I have not been exercising. I have not been drinking the proper amount of water. Now we can do the beginning of the diet, the hardest part of the diet, together. I don't know anyone else that stoop dedicated. This is a brand new video number one. That's why it's called Getting Started and Starting Over. You have the motivation. No one needs to tell you why you want to get in shape. You already know how you'll feel, the things you'll be able to do. You know that even better than I do. You even have the willpower and I'm going to help you find it. What you probably lack is discipline. What most personal trainers and fitness influencers have and don't realize that their followers lack, that most overweight people lack, is discipline. We are going to get that discipline together. Unlike most diets that get harder and harder, this diet gets easier and easier to stick with. You're going to get to the point where you enjoy your exercise and you don't want to miss your workouts. You can still love cheesecake. You can still have cheesecake but the love that you have for yourself will be even stronger than the cravings for junk food. Just as important as your diet and your exercise, maybe even more important is your mindset. So we're gonna get into the diet nights and slowly, and we're gonna learn that mindset. We're gonna learn that discipline. There were so many times when I told myself, I wanna lose the weight, I'm gonna get in shape. And then I went at it too hard. I dieted too hard and my cravings were through the roof. I would go to the gym or I would go out and exercise and I would train so hard, go just completely gung-ho and the next day, I was wiped out and already ready to give up. How many times have you done that? Like I said, this is going to be the last diet of your life. All you have to do is follow the instructions. But think of it like you're going through a maze and I'm giving you instructions. If you don't follow all of the instructions, you're going to get lost. The instructions aren't going to do you any good if you don't follow all of them. So, the revised diet. Right now we're going to focus on the hardest part of the diet, which is getting started. Hopefully you're just as excited as I am. You're going to slowly start to get that discipline. For the first two weeks, all you have to do is light exercise three times a week. Go for a walk, do some body weight exercises at home, go for a bike ride. If you can, go out and have some fun. The other thing you're going to do during the first two weeks of the diet is track your foods. You've probably always got your phone with you. Just open up the notepad app every time you eat something and write it down. Don't worry about what you're eating. Just be diligent about getting your exercise and writing down everything you eat. But I want to be transparent. This diet is slower than most diets, but this diet works and those diets don't. The pace is part of what makes the diet sustainable. It's part of what makes it easy. It's part of what makes it successful. We're gonna get into the whys and the benefits of the pace of the diet in the very next video. Get your exercise going, track your foods. I'll see you in the next video.